More breaking news for you involving a very dangerous situation for police. This is an active shooter situation that suspect just taken into police custody near 2nd and Sooner Road. Mason Dunn over the scene. Mason, update us. Well, this has been going on for a while. We had one person report that somebody was shooting in the neighborhood. He ran over to the coffee shop over here on 2nd Street. This is 2nd, 935, just to the west, kind of to the, uh, the northwest here. Uh, soon after we arrived, this guy came out with a long rifle. You can see it laying there. I believe he also had a pistol with a lot of ammo, the most ammo I've ever seen them put off, uh, pull off of a person. I don't know if he, if the, what the deal is with those bicycles or motorcycles there, but he also had what, what appeared to be a bulletproof vest on. So as uh, we got the takedown on video, we'll have to show that later on, but uh, right now you can see I'm walking this guy off. Uh, he came out, I don't know, I don't, I don't know what else to say, but it was an active shooter situation, and uh, luckily it's came to a good end here. Uh, in Edmond. Mason Dunn reporting from top of four. Back to you. And, uh, mentioning that video yeah. that you were just talking about, uh, the video of the actual takedown. Again, this is near 2nd and Sooner Road, an active shooter situation. A man with a bulletproof vest on is what it appears with a long rifle, some sort of a long gun you see there on the street next to him. Uh, police taking him down just moments earlier. There are also bicycles uh, in the street. This and is he clearly had a, a neighborhood. Had a lot of ammunition, we're being told. More than they'd ever seen. Right. What does what happened before this? What led up to this? Uh, who this person is? We are going to, of course, continue to follow it on the ground and in the air, and on KFOR.com. We'll have more for you uh, coming up on the extra edition. Jolene will have more information for you. It looks like they're loading that person into an ambulance.